Welcome to episode 996, Pollyanna Chu, Queen of Shell Companies and founder of Kingston Financial Group. This is a picture of her family. This is an outline of episode 996. Let us meet Pollyanna Chu. Um, 其实做老板和做一个领袖的分别是哪里? 原來做領袖除了你做了生意好之外人士尤其是女性可以在这里的掌声我是在内心里面发出很大的感谢多谢各位 She was born in 1958 in Hong Kong to poor family She grew up in a fishing village called Ap Le Jiao Then her father made a quick fortune in the 1970s operating casinos and hotels in Macau. In 1976, at the age of 18, she arrived in San Francisco to study. In 1981, she earned a degree in management from Golden State University. She was 21. More importantly, she met her future husband, Nicholas Chu, there, and her only son, Kingston Chu, was also born in San Francisco. In 1992, she returned to Hong Kong upon recommendation of her father. They founded Kingston Financial Group. The company was named after their son, Kingston Chu. IPO 2010. 金立峰2011年借可上市,是香港有名的华资证券商,还经营澳门赌场事业获利不错,在去年第四季股价大涨88%。At the pinnacle in 2016, she became the richest woman in Hong Kong, with a net worth of $4.3 billion. And she was ranked 42nd richest woman in the world. Now, the extravagant wedding of Kingston Chu in 2015. Your love in return. I promise to always take care of you as you have taken care of me. My husband, you are quite simply put, my everything. You are my happiness. Sorry. You are my happiness, my joy, my life. I miss you every moment that we're not together and feel so blessed that we were able to find each other, grow up together, and stay in love in the ever-changing world that we're part of today. We've been together for so long, nine and a half years, that I can't even remember what life felt like before I met you. Now the collapse of the small cab and her fortune. From 2016 to 2021, in just five years, her net worth diminished by more than 75%. The reason? Many of her small cap stocks were kicked out of the exchange, and she was even investigated by the Hong Kong police. And don't worry too much about her. The 62-year-old Pollyanna Chu is still worth a whopping $1.3 billion. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. My next video will be Pollyanna Chu, Eight Lessons, wishing everyone peace and prosperity.